my kids to work this morning and um i thought i was having a bad day blowing a cv joint but the uh the boss is having an even worse day yesterday apparently there was like a mini little tornado come through blue fuel tanks over no more diesel in that one tree the door off the shed's gone that's not the worst thing viewers you know the worst thing is well Hang on a second, I'll walk over there and I'll show you. Anyway, as we wander on over here, viewers, we've, um, well, I don't know how to describe it. It's like a tangled mess of, yeah, copy. Literally, like, about 10 minutes before the storm, they put the headers in the shed to protect the headers from the storm. I think the front one's going to be a write off. It's actually twisted the back, the back section of the header and the fronts there's three fronts in there they're all like not in a good way but the worst thing is the worst thing that really just shits me is you come around the back here and the wind oh the little miniature cyclone has blown the augers open and it's just wrecked it like i literally just finished putting all that back together like a month ago so that auger is wrecked and and then there's um this one in here as we walk in here that one there the shed's actually that auger's holding the shed up like remember people we're in one of the biggest droughts in new south wales in history and these headers actually haven't done anything this year not a thing and they're both, excuse the French mummy, but fucked. And there's a silo out there. No, oh, look, there's the shed. Not bad, things. Look, both fronts are buggered, sitting on trailers in the shed. <sighs> Dear. Like, if you look, there's a, got the shed there. That one's all right. Where these fellas are walking, you can see way over in the paddock over there, there's a tree down, and you can see there's like a <whistles> big spinny thing. That's what they reckon it was. It scares me. You're getting all serious now, mate. I only do it. The newspapers just rock. They want to get photos, and yeah, it got me. You know, I don't know that really something that really confuses me is like, see those planter boxes there? They were sitting there the whole time and right behind it the shed's gone. Like, how does that happen? I don't get it. 